how to manage and organize files on a Samsung Galaxy S5. So just like a uh, Windows computer, you can manage files and organize them so that you can easily find them later. Now first go back to the home screen, then go into apps. In apps, look for my files. Here it is, so it's a yellow folder. So tap on that, and on the top here, you can see there's a search icon, uh, there's a menu icon here, so you can add shortcuts, add, add FTP server, scan for nearby devices, and you can go into settings and do some more things. So you can tap on that uh, middle icon, and it will show you the storage usage. Just tap on OK. Now here's the quick uh, search section that shows you all the recent files that you have opened. Uh, videos files, images, audio, downloaded apps, and documents. Here are the download history, so if you go into that, it shows you all the files that you have recently downloaded to your phone. And below that is a local storage, so it shows you the device storage, which is the phone internal memory. So if you have a 16 gigabyte of memory on your phone, then this will be the device storage. And the SD card is your external memory card that you plug into your phone. And the last option is the cloud storage, which is uh, Dropbox. Now if we go into um, device storage, you can see um, files organized. Uh, here are the Android uh, file system. So it's got sounds, uh, playlist, DSIM, and other things. It's download pictures, books, and also some of the apps folder, such as WhatsApp. Uh, Perfect Piano is an, an app that I've downloaded. It's got books, emergencies, and some other things. So if you scroll down, now within this uh, device search, you can um, tap on the menu key and select files. You can delete, create folder, view mode. You can change the view mode. You can sort the files. You can add shortcuts, and you can go into settings to do some more things. So you can show hidden files or show file extension. Now if we go back here, you can scroll down. Now if you want to um, create a new folder. So let's say I've got a folder temp here, I can go into that, tap on the menu key, and create folder. So tap, give the folder a name, and here it is. To delete a folder, simply tap and hold. Then once you hold it, you can select multiple files, if you wanted to, or folders. And at the top here, just tap on the delete icon, and tap on OK. Then you have been removed a folder. Now you can also copy a file, so tap and hold into that. Now the file is selected, so tap on the menu key, and here you can choose move, copy, rename, or zip, or details. So if you want to copy, just tap on copy, and next it asks you where you want to paste, so you can copy and paste to device storage or to SD card if you wanted to. So we go into SD card, go into test, and paste it here. So there you go, you can see I have uh, successfully pasted here. If I wanted to delete this file, so I can just select the file and tap on the pin icon to delete. So go back. So we have uh, move and copy files. So you can even copy a folder if you wanted to. So you go down here, it's got a Viber folder. So you tap on that. So you can copy or move. You can rename the folder if you wanted to. So if you go into details, it tells you the, the folder size, the name, uh, when it was last modified, and the path to that folder. So that's how you can uh, manage uh, files and organize folders on your uh, S5. So if you want to go into template side and create a new folder, test two, okay, test three. And if I want to copy and move the folder, tap on that, tap on move. So I'm going to device storage, temp, test 3, and tap on move here. You can see that file has been moved down to this folder. If I go back, you can see that file has been moved. I can even tap on here on the path, and it uh, quickly take me back to where I want to go, so local storage. So tapping on the home icon will take me back to the home screen. Not the home screen, but the home root directory of my files. So that's pretty, pretty much it for managing my files. If you have any questions or you don't know what to do, just leave a comment and I can help you out. Thanks for watching this video.